Hi, this is Andrew Moore Crispin for Gadget TV on Butterscotch.com, and today we're taking a look at the Roku HD XR Streaming Video Box. That's this guy right here. And what it is, it's a box that connects to your home network, your wired or wireless home network, and allows you to stream internet content to your HD TV. You can get this guy for about $130. Uh, there are other models available. We'll link to those in the show notes on Butterscotch.com, and they range in price from $80, uh, and there's another one that's $100, and this is the top of the line at $130. So if we take a quick look on the back here, you can see we have component video in. We also have an HDMI port here and an Ethernet port. We can also connect via S-Video, and uh, one difference with the, um, the HD versions of the box is you can actually do optical audio out as well, so you can get surround sound if the cast that you're watching supports that. Take a quick look at the front. You can see it's very simple, just would kind of integrate with your home theater system. IR port over here and a logo badge over here, as well as an LED that lights up to let you know that it's on. Very simple looking from the front. Now it includes this remote in the box, and this remote actually allows you to control the box uh, from across the room. There are no buttons, as you saw, on the front of the box. Now this remote uses a standard, um, a universal remote standard that actually allows you to program the buttons from this remote onto your universal remote. So if you're integrating this with your home theater, uh, you can actually program it into your universal remote, so you don't have to worry about yet another remote sitting on your coffee table. Now the thing we like about this is, like I said, it lets us stream video content uh, from online. Now that's networks like Twit, you can get stuff from Rev3, uh, you can get on-demand movies from Amazon, you can get on-demand movies from Netflix. And we're currently working on um, integrating Butterscotch content with Roku, so stay tuned for that. I really like the interface, uh, quite easy to use, very, very simple. Uh, it's a series of uh, just pressing the buttons on the universal remote, um, sliding across to what you want to open up, and hitting select to open it up. It's very simple. Now this one will get onto your HDTV in up to 720p resolution. It also has 802.11b, G, and N wireless. There's another HD model that has wireless on board. It foregoes the N standard. Now an N is a much faster version of wireless. I would honestly advise, if you're not planning on having an N, 802.11n network in your home anytime soon, to save the $30 and go for the Roku HD, which is 100 bucks. So that's a quick look at the Roku HD XR streaming video box. For Gadget TV, I'm Andrew Moore Crispin. For more sweet stuff, visit butterscotch.com.